What are you making there, Iris? Well, I thought it was getting a bit cold, so I'm knitting us some sweaters. Mm, it is getting colder in here, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, look, it's even started to snow. Oh yeah, it is. Lovely and warm. Mm. Who are these little guys? They are Christmas stick figures. Oh wow, they look like they're having a nice Christmas party. Mm. If you'd like to have a little Christmas stick figure at your Christmas party, all you need is a stick. You can have fun going out and collecting one. I found this nice one here and I think it already begins to look a bit like a figure, if I just take that one off, maybe this one's his arm. Hello. And then you can look out for bits like this in your stick where another branch has been snapped off. Maybe that can become his face. A couple of eyes, a little smile. We just need to give our figure a nice red hat. I've got some red paint that you could use a crayon or colouring pencil. And you could even ask a grown-up to help you shape the hat a little bit more. So if you're a grown-up and you've got a craft knife, you can carefully Cut a nice pointy hat out. Like the one we're wearing. Oh yeah. Probably two different colours as well. A pan, scissors, 
and some glue. You also need something to draw around, a round object. So I'll start by folding one bit of paper in half and using the round object, just measuring about two lengths of that. Draw half of it, like so, and continue the line straight down to the fold. Now I can cut this out and it also works as a template for when I need to cut the other half of the heart out. So if you look, there's two halves and two different ones. Again, I'll fold the paper in half. Place the other half on top. It will need to be exactly the same. Carefully draw around it. And cut it out. So, you can see some bit here, bits here that have been woven. Just need to measure the width of this to make sure that it fits when you're weaving it. Now cut two lines up so you get three strips. So I've got something that looks like this. Now to the weaving. I'll start with my red, the first bit of the red, to be woven in to these three. So there's a gap here and I'll just place this through the gap. So green through red. Now I need to open this up. Be a bit tricky. I'll put red through the green. Blue, get it out here. And now green through the red. So in this gap here. So that was a bit tricky. Just try and continue and do that with the other one. So you alternate. Now the red needs to go in through the green, through the gap, like so. Green inside the red. And again, the red inside the green. this inside so you can fit some treats in there. Now Tom's just cut out a strip for me and this is when we're going to use the glue. So I'm just going to glue the outside of the bottom bit of the strip both sides. Place it inside here open up and you can hang it on your Christmas tree, on your bed, anything like that. I'll put this next to the mouse. So there you have it. Oh, did you say something mouse? Oh, look in the heart by Tom. 
Oh look, this one's got a little Christmas gift in it. It does. So for me. Wow. Let's open it. Oh, thanks, Mr. Mouse. Now we can finally get out and see our friends and family. Just in time for Christmas. Hooray! Hooray! Come and live it again. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Play with us forever. Bye bye. Hi. Merry Christmas. Bye. Merry Christmas.